today is the day. I can't believe it's here. Uh, Only one way to start a road trip. It's not a road trip, which is a trip. And that's at the famous Golden Arches at McDonald's. It's time to eat some sausage and egg with muffins. Beautimus. It's not good for me. Well, that tastes so good. Now that I got some food, I'll tell you where I'm going. I am headed off to Uganda, Africa for a 12-day mission trip. Headed to the Boise Airport right now. Got my beautiful girlfriend Tatiana driving me. Thank you so much. It was funny, last night I sat in bed and God asked me, he said, are you ready? And I kind of chuckled and laughed and I said no, because I don't know if you can fully be ready for what we're about to do and what's about to happen. But I'm willing. So here I am, I'm going. And I'm excited to go. Bye, sweetie. I'll see you in 12 days when I get back. Don't miss that face. And Holy Spirit, just thank you for all the family members that are here and protecting us and praying for us. Holy Spirit, we give you just free reign in our lives to do what you need to do. That God gets glorified and just bless this trip abundantly and abound everywhere we go. In Jesus' name we all said, Amen. Amen. First up, Seattle. First leg of the trip down. How's it going so far, Pastor Bill? It's going good. We got about another, what, 15 and a half to go? Ooh, 15 and a half hours, can't wait. He's on his phone. Oh my God. <laughs> Wesley, you ever left the country before? No, I have not. Are you excited? Yes, super excited. How excited? 17 out of 10. Oh, uh, on, on a scale of hands up in the air to just sitting on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> Scary moment. They almost confiscated my Sour Patch Kids, but I got to take them with me. It's going to be a blessed trip. Just about ready to board the flight to from Seattle to Dubai. It's gonna be 15 hours. Never flown a 15 hour flight before. You ready for it, Gary? Absolutely. Carlton's flown the 15 hour flight before. Carlton, how fun is it? You heard it straight from the source. It's gonna be tons of fun. I really hope I sleep on this flight. Thank you. Here we go. Time to get on the plane. I know them. 43. We have 43, Zach. Got to my seat. Hopefully, I can get some shut eye and uh, wake up and be in Dubai. Going to a country I've never been before. That's exciting. This is, we're almost there. Not really. Yeah. We're like a third of the way yeah, there. Like we're like not even there. We're not even close to being there. So uh, for you, it might be just like two seconds. For me, it's going to be 15 hours. Yes, we finally made it. 14 and a half hours. We are here in Dubai. Woo! We all made it through customs pretty easy, but Zach, on the other hand, he's been getting searched for like the last 10 minutes. Well, it has been a long 24 plus hours that I've been traveling flying. We made it to Dubai. It is freaking hot out here. I didn't sleep maybe about an hour on the flight. So, going to go downstairs, grab a little bit of dinner, get the sack, and it's up early tomorrow, and on our way to do it. Good morning, people. Slept beautifully last night. Now, we're at the airport, getting ready to go to Entebbe, and guess what I found just straight ahead? It's a Starbucks, people. It's a Starbucks. Time to get some coffee, fuel up, and head to our final destination. That tastes good, Kendall. What you got? Peach green tea. Mm. There we go. Got my Starbucks. 
Ready to go. Let's go to Entebbe. Pastor Bill, you ready? Oh, I'm ready. Ready for this last leg? I cannot tell him I'm ready. Starbucks, last chance. You look pretty comfortable to me. You gotta be comfortable. You ready, Wesley? Yes. I am. You ready, Miss Chen? I'm ready. We made it. Finally made it at the airport. We are here in Uganda. Right there. Right there. I want to be more like you. So we finally made it from Entebbe to Kampala and we're here at the Kolping Hotel. Uh, let me show you around just a bit. We hear anything in the background it's because they're having a wedding going on right now and it's pretty legit. They have like 16 layer kick. So I finally made it to Kampala. It's been about two, two and a half days of travel. I've never, I don't think I've traveled so far to get somewhere before. We have Thursday morning. It's now Saturday night with the time change. What is it about? It's about nine in the morning on Saturday in Boise. We lost a day somewhere in between there traveling. Unfortunately, we got to our hotel and we're not really allowed to leave the hotel area just because of safety concerns. But I would love to go outside and show you guys more of what's going on, what it looks like out there. I have to stay in here for the evening. First impressions is this is definitely a different country. It makes you think how blessed you are to live in America, just stuff. Just by first glances looking at things. I'm excited to see what's in store. A crazy week, it's gonna be crazy fun. Uh, so I'm just gonna eat dinner, go to bed tonight. I'm looking forward to going to bed. And then it's gonna be up early tomorrow morning to go, uh, to, go to church. It'll be Sunday, and uh, that's where the real fun's gonna begin. So for right now, I think I'm gonna sign off. Peace.